1678, Christian Huygens comes up with a model for describing waves and wave motion. But he can't describe everything with it. And later, Augustin Jean Fresnel, in 1816, 138 years later, comes up with a way of describing it, how it applies to single slit motion or diffraction, really. So here's the basic idea. A wave front is coming towards an opening. And when I want to describe the wave front, I can describe it as a collection of small particles, just like a line is made up of an infinite number of points. Here's the idea that I have all these points on the line. And each point will will create a wavelet. And here are the wavelets going out. And so these are multiple wavelengths. First wavelength, second wavelength, third wavelength, fourth, etc., etc. And if you draw a tangent line to these wavelengths going around, that becomes the wave front that we see. So you can see that as I'm drawing these tangent lines, you can see how the wave front propagates forward to the right. So we can use these infinite collection of points along a wave front to describe the motion of, and explain what's happening for a single slit experiment.